Gen, gen, film one starts now. Serious film. Nine one starts now. So, uh, Dele Mamadou just told us that Atiku is going to address this country by 3 o'clock today. Not just the country, it's going to be a worldwide broadcast, which means the whole world is going to be watching. You know, this is Atiku called this results. Now, only the one when they show us, now we see. And they have not said anything. Now, we there, they shout, they make noise. Tinubu himself has not said anything. He has not issued any official statement. Peter Bito has not said anything. Now, just their fast. Now, they quote up until now. Atiku just and um, Dele Mamadou just announced by 3 o'clock today. Atiku won't do world conference. He won't tell us what he see. Meanwhile, some of Nati said that when they give Atiku is on, the matter end. Not be there end. On Tuesday, they were still in court. Atiku brought a witness to court. The witness is the registrar at the Chicago State University. The man confirmed, saying he never seen this certificate what he present before. And I'm the registrar. Now, the type of certificate what they present in 1979 is totally different from the certificate people are meant to look at. The design of the one we presented in Buket is the one that Chicago State University started giving out in 1990-something. But President Bola uh, graduated in 1979. So how come they give a future design of certificate? Those are the things that Tiku wants to clear today. We go here and when the broadcast will start. That's one. Secondly, the people when signed President Tinubu's certificate, they never start to work for this course when President Tinubu is signed. Like um, the head of the um, registrar, what they call her, started to work in the school 1998. But she signed President Tinubu's certificate for 1979. Let me show you this news, right? This news I'm about to show you. We give you details of the issue on ground, the questions they ask the witness, and then I'll be right back. Atiku to hold what press conference regarding his discovery efforts at the Chicago State University. The PDP presidential candidate said he is not contending the fact that he never attended Chicago State University, but he forged the certificate he currently parades. The People's Democratic Party's presidential candidate and former vice president Atiku Abubakar has said he will on Thursday, which is today, hold a world press conference on the results of discovery effort at Chicago State University. This is coming after the registrar of Chicago State University, CSU, Mr. Celeb Westberg, on Tuesday, told a court order deposition in Illinois that even though President Bola Ahmed Tinubu graduated from the university, he did not issue the CSU Diploma Certificate Tinubu submitted to the Independent National Electoral Commission for the 2023 presidential run. Weisberg made the disclosure while responding to questions from Angela Liu, lawyer to former Nigerian Vice President Atiku Abubakar in a United States legal proceedings. Atiku had sought to nullify the declaration of Tinubu as president by INEC. He currently has a pending appeal at the Supreme Court following the dismissal of his petition against the February 25th election that produced Tinubu as president. A five-member panel of the Presidential Election Tribunal had, in a unanimous judgment on September 6th, held that Atiku could not prove his allegations of irregularities, non-compliance, as well as corrupt practices during the presidential election. Besides, the panel declined to entertain Atiku's prayer for the disqualification of Tinubu from the poll over alleged forgery and perjury on the grounds that the allegations were not part of the former vice president petition filed on March 21, 2023. Atiku believed that by Nigerian's law, a candidate could be barred from participating in an election over acts of forgery and lying on oath. Among the documents Tinubu submitted last year to INEC was a diploma certificate said to have been obtained from CSU in 1979. The documents like this educational history was emerged in great controversy, leading to the instant litigation in the United States. Apart from the U.S. case, one Mike and now Eba and some civil society groups had earlier gone to court to stop Tinubu's participation in the last presidential election. The different cases were dismissed on the ground that complaints and plaintiffs lacked the necessary legal rights to institute the legal action. Just like the earlier suits filed at the High Court, the former Vice President claimed at the Tribunal that the CSU certificate Tinubu submitted to INEC was forged. In arguing this case, he called a witness, Enaru Eba, 
who not only testified of the alleged abnormalities in Tinubu certificate, but also tendered a copy he obtained from the same CSU, which gave conflicting dates, logos, signatories, and forms, and forms from the one Tinubu submitted to INEC. Now, these are the questions the court asked the witness. Question 1. The diploma said it was granted on June 22, 1979. Witness answered yes. Question. And CSU did not have a board of trustees in 1979, did it? The witness said true. Question. So let's look at the signatories, signature on the INEC diploma on the right. It looks like one of the signatories were Enola Daniel. Correct? Witness said yes. Question. And Enola Daniel was not on the share of president of CSU in 1979, correct? The witness said yes. She was president from 1998 to 2008, correct? The witness said as far as I am aware. Similarly, while the witness identified another signature on the diploma Tinubu submitted to INEC as that of Herbert Conley, he admitted that Conley was not the dean of the Faculty of Business Administration in 1979. Fourteen further, the seal on the diploma with INEC, the witness stated that the word responsibility and year 1867 were missing. The question and answer continued thus. Question. And you are unaware of any diploma that includes these three signatures being issued by CSU? Witness answered correct. And you have never seen a diploma that cut off the triangle seal in this manner? Witness answered correct. You have never seen a diploma that cut off the signature of Albert Conley position like this. Witness answered correct. And CSU does not have a 1979 diploma that contains the font CL signatories and wordings apart from the INEC diploma. Witness answered correct. So CSU does not know any diploma dated 1979 like the INEC diploma that has been issued. Witness answered correct. And CSU has no record of issuing this INEC diploma to President Tinubu in 1979, witness answered correct. And CSU does not issue a diploma dated June 27, 1979 to Tinubu in 1979, witness answered correct. You see, um, apart from the fact that some of us will not be really President Tinubu fan, apart from the fact that we will celebrate this matter, say there might be hope, I am really bothered. I am bothered because we are embarrassing our country to the whole world. Some people don't apply for visa. Embassy tell their live and direct. So now people to the full certificate. Live and direct. Now they say they, they, they send them. They get the letter where they send. Why they, why we deny your visa? Some of these certificates we have found out are easily forged in Nigeria. Now we are telling the world that there is a probability that the result of our president is using mind to be forged. We are just embarrassing ourselves. So the world, if there was a way we could have handled this thing internally, maybe the whole world knows him. If a better boy is there a way, there's no way. So tomorrow when we land in foreign airports and they see us finish, hope we'll stop blaming the white man. We have not respected ourselves. This is all they talk now. So our ministers, they say, I beg, I beg, I beg, no get time to handle issues of result. Because we are fooling ourselves in this country. No wala. May we wait for Atiku Abubakar. He go go tell us in details he find it because the small finding when we they see for newspaper now they shock us. Not to talk about the ones where we never know. Like I said, I don't go surprised. This will be tell us say the female where they don't result. There's a name in every female. Let's wait till two o'clock. I'll bring you the gist when you do the word conference.